just as you know, looking at coming into camp this year, what are your expectations for yourself uh, as you get ready to start the new season? Uh, I'm just trying to get better every day, work hard, uh, and uh, show these guys uh, that uh, I can play hockey here. I was talking with uh, Neil Little earlier, and, and he's saying obviously they, they love they love your size and, and your talent, and, and they really feel like playing three years pro in Finland equates a lot to uh, the AHL and the way the game is played over here. Do you have you talked to some people and gotten the sense that it's going to be a, pretty similar for you when you once you get out there? Uh, yeah, well, obviously the hockey is a little different here because of the smaller rink and everything, but uh, yeah, it helps a lot that been playing pro for a couple of years and uh, feel like I'm, uh, I'm ready to take the next step. But when you look at uh, what, what you have here, you have you and you have Cal and then you have Scott Monroe who's a, who's a veteran. Do you feel, look at it and say, hey, competition's always a good thing? You know, to always, you know, so you don't always know. Yeah, of course. Next. For sure, for sure. <laughs> that, that, one, that makes everyone, everybody a little bit better every time there's a little competition and uh, it's that's the way it's supposed to be, and uh, it's it's good. We have three good goalies here, and uh, everybody's fighting for the spot. What what is there anything specifically that you're hoping to accomplish here in camp? Things, something that you're looking to to address or or, or, or work on specifically as you get ready to start the season in a couple. Of weeks? Yeah, just trying to get my game game back on. Like it's been what over five months since I last time I played, and. Uh, Really, really looking forward to the first game, and yeah, just trying, trying to get ready for the season. Are you anxious for that since it's been so long? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. And I, I, I had a tough, tough end of the season uh, with the uh, little, little hip problem there, and uh, yeah, just pretty, pretty fired up. I hear you're uh, bringing the family over. Yeah, I got a, I got a wife and a little daughter, seven months old, coming over, which is, which is nice. Uh, that uh, don't have to be here alone, and. Uh, it's, it's nice. Wait, when is she going? Is she going to come over for the start of the season? Is, is that uh, we we haven't really decided yet. We'll see see after camp how how things work out and uh, yeah. Have, have you been to the U.S. before? Has she been to the U.S. before? Yeah, we were here this summer for two months after my surgery. So uh, yeah, that actually helped a lot. Kind of the first time. In the US? I've been in the U.S. actually when I was drafted by Minnesota. I went on their summer camp a couple of times and. Uh, yeah, it's it's not my first time. I uh, right. know a little bit where to go and what to do here. Um, last year for you, before the hip thing in Finland, uh, did you consider that to be your best season? Uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, we uh, we played really good as a team last year, and it was just fun fun being part of it. And uh, yeah, I'm uh, I'm pretty pretty happy about. How things worked out at the end of the season, like we made the finals and uh, came up short a little bit. Even though I was injured, I was injured. I was still able to play a couple of games, and I was pretty happy about that. And uh, especially playing in the playoffs made me made me a better goalie for sure. The one position that Flyers fans are always interested in is goaltender, right? So if, if I have to tell them in this story, you know who you always idolized your uh, idolized growing up or, or who you modeled yourself after who would that be uh, probably Kari Lettinen from Dallas okay. I uh, I saw him play probably like nine ten years ago when he was 17 for the first time and then I just liked his style right away right away he uh, he won the championship in Finland when uh, when he was 17 so I've been c- kind of following him since that and uh, yeah pretty much him Okay. This this camp for you, uh, it's also important just to get to know who your teammates are. I mean, you probably only sort of know most of these guys coming in. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I was kind of nervous actually the first day. I didn't really know anyone, and uh, Eng- English isn't my first language, so it's kind of kind of hard to uh, like like chat chat with the boys and things like that. But yeah, feeling better every day, feeling more confident, and. Uh, uh, really, really anxious about how the week is going to end. Great. Good for me. That's all I need. Thanks.